long time no see. I haven't made a YouTube video in a really long time. And for that, I am sorry. I have no excuse. Um, but I'm hoping today to make something really cool because I am going to be doing a Habitat for Humanity project. Woohoo! Water bottle. Cheers. Um, I've had a bit of an anxious tummy this morning. I think it's probably because of the shoe situation. Okay, let me just start off by saying this. I discovered, I probably knew this for a while, but I just accepted this finally, that when I'm doing an activity with a group and I'm not the one organizing the activity, I get a lot of anxiety over, not a loss of power, but just not knowing everything about the thing, about the project. So one of the problems that I faced was that I didn't know, and this is, I guess, my own stupidity and not researching, that you had to have like certain type of shoes to be doing this project. It only makes sense, it's construction. But I thought sneakers would be fine, but they're not. And so I've been having a like freak out over the past couple of days trying to find some like rubber soled like boots can't find any in my size um or if i can they're crazy crazy expensive and i ain't about that life i'm just not so um pastor bob recently said oh that's the guy at my church obviously his first name's not pastor that'd be really weird <laughs> if his last name was bob his first name was pastor but um, he's like, oh, they have shoes there. You can borrow them. Mm. What if they don't have my size? What if they're icky? So many factors. Okay, I gotta cross the street. Be back later. We've reached the building site. You can kind of hear a little bit of the construction already happening. Here's some other people. Hey, they didn't get permission for me to be here. <laughs> Um, I thought this was kind of cool. It's a little, it's a little man right here. Just so you guys know, I did, well, I did get shoes. Hey, oh, I look so, so cute right now. Never look better in my life. Okay, hi. So, I'm about to get down to work. I'll video more later. I have this hard body. Oh my god. I don't want people to think I'm lazy. Just wanted to show this is what 45 minutes of um, carrying buckets of dirt and dumping onto a pile looks like. I mean, it's not, not, it's not as bad as you think, but you know you're pale when someone you just met who doesn't even know your name comes up to you and says, Do you need sunblock? I have some. So I'm like, No, I, I put it on already. Yep. Actually, I think, don't be concerned. I think I'm red because I'm just hot. So, update later. Bye. So, I've just um, spent some time drilling, which was pretty interesting. I discovered I'm pretty crap at it. It's not a big shocker. But I think I'm doing all right. Um, we're about to get a new assignment. I'm, um, where is it? It's eating an apple. That's what's up, guys. I don't look as red anymore because I've been in the basement. Oh my god, am I being really low right now? Because I have these in. You'll be okay. So, it's going pretty well. I haven't passed out. So, I forgot to videotape lunch because I was too hungry. I had a sandwich. It's delicious. Uh, we're back. About to go back down into the basement. We're drilling. Well, we're not really we're removing screws from these metal things. Oh wait, looks a little bit like these things. So we're taking out oh, 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 all these screws. So we're gonna go back and do that. No clue what the next step is, but I wanted to kind of show you guys. I don't know. Can you tell how disgusting I am? All right, so I'll update you guys when I'm done. So 
obviously I'm at home and I've taken a shower. And trust me, everyone's glad about that. It was not good. It's not good at all. So, um, I just wanted to give you like a summary of what happened there at the end after the last segment of the video. Oh my god, I just felt my bicep. I'm so strong. <laughs> um, instead of going back down and removing more of those screws, we actually ended up shoveling rocks. Shoveling rocks. At one point I tried to get some singing going. No one was interested. It was not easy work and um, I already kind of feel sore so I know tomorrow I'm gonna be like in a lot of pain. Which is, you know, I guess par for the course. But I do just want to say that it was a good experience and I really encourage everyone to participate in Habitat for Humanity because it's for you know a great cause and uh, you make new friends which I did and that's pretty much it have a great weekend guys bye